Bringing a video into Blender as an object can look a little flat. If you could turn that video into a 3D object, it would pick up the lighting from the scene and look like it fits into the world a lot better. That would make it feel more natural. You can do this using displacement. In fact, it doesn't take a lot of displacement for the lights to get picked up by the object. But you would need a displacement map for every frame of the video. There's a way in Photoshop you can generate this automatically. Go to Actions, start a new action, and hit Record. Now, select the Layer Transparency. Open a new Gradient Adjustment Layer. Set the Gradient Type to Black to White. Set it to Radial. Reverse it so that white is in the middle and that's what gets pushed forward. And then make sure you align with the layer. That's what allows Photoshop to make every frame different. Now, save it into a new folder. Now go to Automate, Batch. Select your Source folder and then select your Output folder. And Photoshop will generate all of those frames for you. Back in Blender, add a new displacement modifier. Click New and for the texture, select all of those files that you just generated. Blender will import them as an image sequence. The default settings need a little bit of adjustment, so go back to the modifiers and play around with the strength until you get something more realistic. As you can see, it doesn't take much for the lighting to get picked up and to affect the way it looks, but you'll see that some frames are messed up. So you'll want to add a corrective smooth modifier and play with those settings until it looks more natural. But that's it. Then you have a video that's reacting to the lighting around it because it's being transformed into a 3D object. Thanks for watching.